Okay, um, just a really very quick and simple um, introduction to arrays, radial arrays in particular. To make something like this little bottle lid, um, where we've got this repeated pattern of these kind of scalloped cutouts going around um, the outside edge. So how am I going to do that? If I show you something similar, here's a, 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 um, a simple extrusion. So it's a circle, it starts off with a circle. And uh, you'd be given a size. I'm just going to make it that size for now, and it becomes an extrusion. Um, that'll do. That's fine. So we've got a shape like this, and what you want to do is you want to cut a little bit out all the way over. Now I could um, start by drawing a sketch here, and if I wanted to draw a, a circle on a cutout, um, I'm going to draw myself a, another little circle. Let's just make that ten. <coughs> And now I've snapped sent my circle to the edge of my <coughs> main shape. So that pitch of that circle, the PCD, will be on the drawing. The pitch is going to be on the diameter of this, whatever that is. Um, when I cut it, I'll end up with just that little shape. But it started off as a circle, obviously. So that's 10. So there we go. Now, I can now extrude um, on, on this bit here. And I want to subtract, I want to remove, subtract that all the way through, like so. So there's one of them. Now, obviously, I could, um, on this sketch here, I could draw, sorry, not that one, sketch two. I could draw lots of these all the way around here, but that would be a pain. Um, I'd have to work out the spacing and dimension the um, angles between them and everything else. But there's a better way of doing that. Um, I can use this. In, on the shape it's called a circular pattern, SQA is called a radial array, also we have linear arrays which we'll look at in a different video. So if I'm going to do that, what I need, just to show you, I need to uh, a couple of elements. We want a um, feature pattern because we're going to pattern this feature. Um, we're going to select the pattern, which is going to be that one. Um, but then actually, if it's going to work, we need to tell the um, modeling software where the axis is that we're going to spin this round. So we're going to have to go back. We're going to have to put an axis in. In this example, that's going to be coming up from this center point, and it's going to be vertically. If you imagine like a, a, the, the actual, literally the actual pin that a, a, a wheel would, would rotate on, that's what we want. A bit like when we did our, our revolve. So I pick one of these um, vertical uh, sketch planes, and I want it to be going up the way. It doesn't matter how long that line is, as long as it starts in the center, as you can see there. So what I can do now is I can go back to my um, pattern tool, my radial array. Again, it's going to be a feature pattern, not a part pattern. Features to pattern is that one, and the axis is that one there. Um, now, default, it just gives you four, and it spaces them out, and it does them about the, the whole shape. Let me up that up to maybe eight. See what it looks like. Okay, that would do. Um, and we can okay that. So there we've got that that shape. Now, just one thought. If I look at this example here, I've got a fillet along that top edge. Okay, now if I go back to this one here, if I was to try and put that fillet in now, it's going to be a right pain because I'm going to have to click them all. And I could do it, and that would it would work. And um, what we're best to do is remember we've got this rollback bar. So if I was to just go back above my circular pattern, I can then, oops, hang on, I'm going to need to go above my um, extrusion as well. And I'm going to put that fillet on there, like that. And now when I roll, um, roll this back forward, it's going to cut that out. And it's going to cut all those out with that fillet in place. So it's just thinking of order. Anything else I need to do on that bottom face now, I can just add in. So very simple introduction to um, a radial array, or as Onshape calls it, a circular pattern.